Are you searching for a new way to teach hybrid lessons in your classroom? Maybe you've been bogged down standing in front of your computer all day, wishing that you could actually walk out in front of your students. But what do you do? You've got a camera like this and you've got amazing students. Well, I'm here today to say, let's throw this thing out and let's do something new because today we're going to be taking a look at the DL30 camera. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to EdTech in the Classroom. My name is Jeff Bradbury, and today I am so excited to be showing off the brand new DL30 multimedia camera from our friends at Avery. There are so many different things that this thing can do. Let's take it out of the box and see what it can do. Here we have it, the DL30 camera. This thing is absolutely amazing. It is, as you can see, a durable camera. And on the back, there are plenty of connections. There's so many great things about this camera, but you don't have to take my word for it. With me today is Chuck from Abram. Chuck, can you tell us a little bit about this amazing device? Hi, Jeff. Thanks for uh, letting me be here and do this. So we're gonna go over the DL30. I'm gonna show you a little bit about how the tracking works. I'm gonna also go over the uh, what's called zone tracking, and that works in a linear fashion. It goes from left to right, and you can have up to four zones. You can select two, three, or four. And just to let you know, if you're going to use zones, we also have preset modes, and on the remote control, presets are from one to nine plus zero. However, when you use the zone mode, it is reserved for preset numbers six, seven, eight, and nine. So anytime you use a uh, zone, you are using up those preset numbers. Hopefully that makes sense. So let me go ahead and activate this for uh, a tracking on. So I'm gonna do that and it looks like it should be activated. And you notice that we're immediately in the tracking mode. So this is the uh, presenter tracking mode. It just means that it'll track me whether I'm close, keep me in focus, or I could walk at a distance in the classroom and it'll keep me in focus. I could go anywhere that I want. Now, presets are really nice because when I first started out, I had it on preset. So let me do that real quick. So here's the preset, preset number two, Preset number three is gonna show the entire classroom. Now remember, you can designate your presets to do whatever you want. Now here's something that's really great. I'm using preset number four to show my teacher desk, my teacher area, my podium. I've got my book here. This is approximately a, a five times zoom, and we're about a distance of about nine and a half feet. So the DL30 has a 12 times optical and a two times digital zoom. This is what it looks like when I'm using the 12 times optical. So it's really powerful. It zooms right in there. The image is very, very clear. And like I said, it does have a digital mode and you see it gets right in there and it is still very, very clear. So let me come back out here. This is preset number three again. It's showing everything in the classroom. And here's what's really nice. If I wanna go back to tracking, I just press tracking on and it's tracking right away. So this is what's really, really great about this camera is that it's really seamless for the teachers. Now I did mention that we have zone tracking. So that's gonna go from a linear fashion. And let me show you that right now. So I'm going to turn off my auto tracking and I'm going to go into zone tracking. And all of this is on the remote control. Bottom right hand corner, it says zone. I press zone, press on. And this is my first zone right here. So how the reason to have zone tracking is maybe I want to focus in on a specific area. Now, you know, if I was in a standard tracking, the presentation mode tracking, it's gonna show all of me and the monitor. On the zone tracking, I could hone in on or zoom in on the monitor. Now I can't just go very, very tight. It has to at least see a part of me. I say about a third of the person because it has to know that you're crossing from 
one zone to the next. So let me give you a quick example. I'm going to walk over to the next zone and it comes right over to my chalkboard. So I'm right here, so now I'm talking. And again, I can move back over to my other zone and come right back here. So that's how zone tracking works. And again, seamless. So once I'm ready to go back into a tracking mode, I just press off. And then I could go ahead and either press tracking on or just press the upper body or lower body for auto tracking. And let's see, let's get us on here. It should be tracking me. Yep, here we are, right here. So that's how it works. So very, very simple. So back to you. Chuck, that is amazing. I love the fact that this is great for both distant learning, hybrid classrooms. It is a full 1080 resolution camera, 12 times optical zoom. And I love the fact that you can walk all around your classroom, don't have to have a necklace on, don't have to be tethered anywhere. This just works, whether it's on your desk, whether it's on the ceiling. This knows exactly what to do, and there is no doubt that your teachers are going to love these things. I guarantee it, if you put these things in every single classroom, your teachers are going to love and enjoy it. And you never know, next year, your students are going to love to use this thing too. So check out all the great stuff over at Avery. And I hope you guys have a chance to access that DL30 today. And if you're looking for more information, you can check it out over on teachercast.net slash DL30. And we hope you guys have a chance to hit that like and subscribe button. Smash that bell. And we are here each and every week on TeacherCast providing you great updates and ed tech tools for your classrooms. So on behalf of my friends at Avery and everybody here on the TeacherCast Educational Network, my name is Jeff Bradbury, reminding you guys to keep up the great work in your classrooms and continue sharing your passions with your students.